Thanks for joining us. Heart disease is responsible for one in five deaths in the U.S. every year. That's according to the CDC. February is American Heart Month, and as First News at Nine's Daniel Gomez shares, medical professionals use this time to raise awareness about heart health. The heart is remain the number one cause of death in the United States and in the industrialized countries. Dr. Mohamed Shabaklo, a cardiologist with Marshfield Medical Center in Eau Claire, says it's important to listen to your heart. Our body always tries to tell us something, to don't ignore it and to be upfront about addressing it. And aside from the usual tools like an EKG, a stress test, and a heart echo, there's one question doctors always ask that gives potentially life-saving insight. Family history being one of the most important uh, uh, guideline. That is because it can help doctors like Chabaclo determine if you're at risk for an arrhythmia or anything that threatens your heart rhythm. While we all worry about heart attacks, it's cardiac arrest that Chabaclo says we should be most concerned about. That is because cardiac arrest is when your heart stops beating altogether, and it doesn't need a heart attack to make that happen. According to the American Heart Association, heart disease is an array of problems that can make it harder for blood to flow through the arteries. Heidi Dowd, a nurse practitioner with Purveyor Health, says there are factors to consider. Some people are genetically predisposed to heart disease. Other people develop heart disease based on lifestyle choices, such as inactivity, smoking, or dietary choices. Dowd says, while it may seem like things are okay right now, it can be dangerous to stick with certain bad habits. I think there's a lot of people that don't appreciate that heart disease is something that develops over time. It's not a disease you get overnight. Heart attacks are becoming more common at younger ages, Dowd says. We're seeing heart disease in younger people now than we ever have before. Um, it's not uncommon to see people in their 40s and 50s that are having heart attacks. Dr. Chabaklo says when a heart attack happens, you will know. Based on my experience, people when they have a heart attack, they know it. They always tell me that they had pain that they never felt before. So he offers this advice to keep the old ticker going. The first important thing is to be happy, to live a happy life, to, be, to enjoy life. Daniel Gomez, First News at 9.